In this video, we're going to discuss the color palette, which is one of the first things that you're going to want to set up in Macabacus. As you can see right up here, we're in the Macabacus documentation page, which is macabacus.com forward slash docs. And we want to go right here where it says configuration and then click into color palettes. As you may know, Microsoft Office comes with Office theme colors, but there's really two downsides to working with these solutions. One issue with these native Office theme colors is that they work on a document level. What this means is that the theme colors can change from one document to another. Another big issue is that you can only actually fully customize eight theme colors. The other colors get dictated to you by Microsoft. Macabacus is going to completely overcome this problem for us. As we can see down here, where we're showing the default color palette that Macabacus installs with, we have a large palette of colors to choose from. Right in this grid, we can see that it's actually eight squares wide and seven squares tall. So eight times seven gives us 56 colors that are completely customizable from Macabacus. What's even better? We can go into this dialog box and create a brand new color palette and then push that out across our entire organization to make sure that we're all on the same page in terms of brand compliance. Let's hop into these settings in the next video. We'll see you there. If you're enjoying these tips and would like to see more of our content, please like and subscribe to the channel. Thank you so much for your support and we'll see you soon in the next video.